Hello again, YouTubers on with SpongeBob 101, back here again on the SpongeBob channel. Today is May 31st, 2023, and it is the second anniversary of the closure, quote unquote closure, of a SpongeBob Moves In. So SpongeBob Moves In, if you don't already know what that is, it was basically a city building mobile game that was released on Apple iOS and on Android devices. SpongeBob Moves In was launched on June 6th, 2013. In fact, we're actually almost up till the 10th anniversary of the launch of Spongebob Moves In and personally Spongebob Moves In has always been my favorite Spongebob mobile game and when it was announced that it was closing down it was such a bummer but today well it's still working so here we are on my Spongebob app page on my iPad let's head into Spongebob Moves In. So unfortunately, if you never downloaded Spongebob Moves In before it was removed from app stores, well, you can't really do anything about it anymore. I think you could download the APK if you're on Android or something like that. But if you're on Apple devices, well, you kind of limit it there. So interesting thing, a lot of folks have been commenting on previous Spongebob Moves In videos on how they rediscovered Spongebob Moves In well, this year or last year, and uh, was saying that their data was gone. So to address that, actually, I want to point out one thing. If you are on an Apple device and you remember using Game Center back when you played SpongeBob Moves in whenever that was um, in the past, right? If that was the case, make sure you are signed into Game Center on your current Apple device because it might be the case that your save data was tied to that Game Center account. Just like in my case right here, I still have the account that we use for our playthrough of SpongeBob Moves In, well, many years ago. I can't really say anything more than it is working because there are no online functionalities in the sense that you kind of like buy and sell decorations with another player around the world or something. You can go to your friend's Bikini Bottom town, you know, all you can do really is go to Patchy's Bikini Bottom, which um, now it does say ops. We were unable to load Patchy's town at this time. Come back later. Well, I don't think we'll be coming back later to that very soon because it's not going to be back. So yeah, now that is one thing that has changed since 2022. And I think it's probably the only thing that has actually changed. In terms of the store, you can still buy stuff as per usual with currency that you already have. As you can see, I've previously completed the store thing, uh, got one of everything in here. And now interesting thing here, can you still buy jelly? So let's try. Please wait while your purchase is being processed. Purchase it. And we are back. So it turns out trying to make an in-app purchase and canceling out crashes your game. Not a real great way to encourage people to buy in-app purchases. But as you can see, you know, collecting coins, we can still make buns in the bakery just like we always did for, well, up, almost up to 10 years now. So that's really nice that the game still works. And although there are no updates, it's great to be able to, you know, save that progress that you've made over the years and still be able to look back at the Bikini Bottom town that you crafted yourself. So, of course, everything is still here. Again, there was no like a player to player interaction. It was just basically you and your town, your interaction with the Bikini Bottomites like here, Plankton. We can tell them to go steal robotic parts for a project or something so yeah quests still work experience still counts and uh, you can still level up i believe the level up limit was raised to 40 or was it 35 i couldn't remember i remember that when the game first released the maximum level was 30 so or was it 31 <laughs> yeah um Okay, maybe I'm not so sure after all, huh? But yeah, so here's just a quick look at our town again that we had in our SpongeBob Moves In playthrough over the years. If you are interested in watching that, of course, feel free to check out the playlist link in the description box below. And uh, all the videos that I've made on SpongeBob Moves In on the channel thus far are all there. So yeah, if you are just rediscovering SpongeBob Moves In, well, if you are on iOS, then you, that's basically the best position because uh, if you've downloaded it before, just re-download the app, make sure you log into Game Center, and you should be able to get your progress back. If you're on Android, that's going to be a little bit tougher because support is no longer available for SpongeBob Moves In. So what happens previously was that if you lost your save file, you could always 
go to support and tell them your uh, support number and they can relink your save file for you that's no longer available you won't be able to do that so uh well i mean i'm pretty happy that i'm using ios here now one more thing i totally forgot you can still move stuff around and reposition them yeah so uh basically the game works as per normal except for patchy's town and uh, the in-app purchases might be a little wonky. You probably shouldn't make any in-app purchases on a game that is no longer supported by like, you know, the companies. Let me know in the comments if you still have been playing SpongeBob Moves in two years after the quote unquote closure. I'm really happy that it didn't close in the sense that uh, we lose all access to the game entirely. It just meant that basically support was no longer available so they could remove liability in case anything happens. Um, and also, basically no new content but it's okay you know i'll take this uh, frozen state of affairs for a sponge that moves in over having everything deleted so that's all for this video guys i'll make sure to make a video like this basically every year just coming back to look at spongebob moves in which is again my favorite spongebob mobile game ever thanks for watching make sure to subscribe like and i'll see you guys in the next spongebob video coming real soon till then bye